I got a special treat for you in this ukulele, nope, big baritone ukulele review. We are going over the Pono, big baritone, but this one is the, this is the steel string version, and this one is a special model with the cedar and the rosewood sides and back. This is the Pono, big baritone, UL 4-4. Welcome to You Like the Pros. I'm Terry Carter. And do you know that we give away ukulele every single month right here on our channel? That's right. <laughs> and all you got to do is super easy. Make sure to subscribe right here, You Like the Pros. Might as well turn on that bell notification while you're at it. And then click that link below to go sign up. Totally free to sign up. Once you sign up, you're entered to win that monthly ukulele giveaway that we do right here on my channel. So, I was asked yesterday, actually, during the baritone Q&A that we do over at my instructional site, youcollectthepros.com. We do these live Q&As for all the premium and the brand new platinum membership. And they asked me, you know what, could you do a review on this steel string version of the big baritone? And I've already done one on the nylon string, and then I've done one on the big, big baritone as well. So I was like, you know what, that's a great idea, and I'm going to do that, and that's what I'm doing right now here on this channel. All right, I'm gonna go over all this, what makes it a big baritone, what, why the steel strings, all that kind of stuff so you fully understand here and know all the dimensions of this right here, this ukulele. And if you like this, this ukulele or any other thing, baritones, whatever, store.youcollectthepros.com, your number one site for all your ukulele needs. So if you're ready, I'm ready, let's dive in. <laughs> I got more playing for you coming up. We'll do some strumming, all that kind of stuff. But let me help you understand these and what they are, a big baritone. And then they have a big, big baritone. And then the nylon strings. And then the steel strings and all that kind of stuff here. Okay, So as a huge Pono dealer <laughs> and as a big baritone, not only player, teacher, but also seller, um, I, I have a better understanding of this stuff. And it took me a while to understand all the different models of the Pono. So let's just spend a second going over that. And then I'll tell you why this one with the cedar and the rosewood is such a special and a unique instrument. All right, so first of all, Pono has basically three different baritones. They have just your normal baritone ukulele. Okay? Then they have this step up, which is called the big baritone. These come in two versions, steel string version and a nylon string version. And then they have one called the big, big baritone. Okay, and that one's even bigger than this. It's almost like a, a tenor size guitar. Okay, so you got your normal baritones, you got these, which is the UL4, okay, that's the steel string version, or the ULN4 for the nylon string version, okay, and then they have the big, big one, which are really cool. And by the way, I have videos on all of these too, and that's the BN4 for the big one, okay, but this one right here, this is a UL4 four dash four okay they have dash one dash two dash three and then the dash four which is cool because they don't make this dash four very often okay now i just have this one for the video although i do have all of them up for sale at store you click the pros.com all right let's talk about this this is all part of the pro classic series okay they're all part of the pro classic series and that what that means premium wood okay so just a little bit nicer premium wood they use gloss finish binding and what's really cool on this one it has the maple binding on it and just overall just a little bit more quality put into these pro classic series all right so uh, all right let, let me just play a little bit let me play a little bit and then we're going to go over the dimensions a little bit the steel string all that kind of stuff all right so what do you think so far leave a comment below if you're just kind of digging the overall vibe of this instrument <laughs> Let 
coming here. <laughs> All right. So, no, break it of wood here, and then we'll talk about the steel strings. All right, so solid cedar top, okay? So the this one, which is a UL4-4, the UL4-1, which is solid cedar and acacia wood, UL4-2, which is solid cedar top and mahogany, and then the UL4-3, which is all solid mango, even the top, okay? But this one has a solid cedar top. Look at that. I mean, cedar is a really great, great wood, right? I mean, it's it's used a lot in guitars, classical guitars a lot. And by the way, I mean, this kind of thing, this vibe with the steel strings, it really, it feels like it kind of gears itself to those that like maybe play guitar, like the way of a sound that the steel strings give, which is a little bit brighter, right? A little bit brighter um, and just kind of more guitaristic sounding. So I dig them. I think they're absolutely fantastic. I think they sound fantastic. I have a mic here and I have a mic here, but nothing's plugged in. You're not going through any kind of effects or anything like that. All right, so you got the solid cedar top. Now these Pro Classics have, well, one, the purfling, which is the purfling goes here, but they also have the binding top and bottom. Now what unique about this one, it has the maple. Look how cool that is, the maple binding. Then you have the solid rosewood sides and back. Look at the back of this one. I mean, just absolutely phenomenal, absolutely phenomenal back on this one. And this is the rosewood. So this cedar rosewood, I mean, it's a beautiful, beautiful combination. A wood, I mean, the cedar provides a nice kind of warmth to the sound, but yet still has nice projection. And then the rosewood, just a really bold, powerful wood. And this is really like a combination that like a luthiers would love. Like cedar, rosewood. I mean, they just love that particular combination of, of wood on this one. All right, so you got the gorgeous woods. Again, the other models just have different woods, but this one is that special UL4-4, okay? Um, now you have the solid mahogany neck. Really nice neck, satin finish, really smooth, okay? Really nice neck. Then you got the Pono headstock here with the ebony head plate. You got the nice tuners here, all right? Now, a couple things here on these scale lengths. So this one, all the Ponos, even these big baritones, have an inch and three-eighths scale lengths here at the nut. Okay, so some people will say, uh, it's not big enough, I have big hands, stuff like that. Totally understandable, okay? I understand, because I'm with you on that. But I've found that with these Ponos, I don't find myself too cramped down here, and if that helps. All right, now the scale length. All right, so most baritones, when you measure the scale lengths from the nut here, to the saddle, most baritones, typical baritone is 20 inches. Okay, that's your standard. Now this one has 21 and a half inches, right? So you got a little bit of a longer scaling. So that's one reason why it makes it a big baritone. Okay, a little longer scaling. You got the ebony fretboard here as well. Now, the other thing is the body. Okay, so this is a bigger body than most traditional baritone ukuleles. Now it is still tuned D, G, B, E. Okay, still tuned like a baritone. You could tune it like a regular ukulele, G, C, E, A, but this one, like most baritones, come with that D, G, B, E tuning on it. All right, now, the body length, okay? So if I'm talking about the body length, I'm talking about from here to here, about 15 and three quarters inches. All right, this is not like to the exact minimum, just a basic measurement right here, boom. And then the overall scale length from the top here to the back, 32 inches on the overall scale length. Now, what makes it a Big baritone too is this lower bow. Okay, so this is a lower bow here. This 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 part right here from this to this. So this one right here, because look at here, boom, right there. This lower bow is 11 and a quarter inches. Okay, boom. And then what's cool about this one, it has a little bit of a thicker body, three and a quarter inches right there. So that makes it a big baritone. All right. And then fret wise, boom, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18 frets. Is that right? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18 frets. <laughs> All right, so let's do a little playing. What should I do? I don't know, let me do something and then uh, we'll get on out of here.
I didn't even know what I was doing there. <laughs> I just was like, I was kind of warming up. And I was like, this roll with that. So there you go. What do you think? Leave those comments below. This again is a Pono. This is the big baritone. Remember, two versions. Nylon string version, which is a UL and four. And those come in the different wood combinations. And then this is the steel string version, the UL4-4. And again, these come in different wood combinations, but this one is a cedar with the acacia sides and back. Absolutely phenomenal. By the way, these do come with a hard shell case. Actually, let me grab it. So here's a hard shell case, and thank goodness they do come with a hard shell case because trying to find a case for this thing would be nearly impossible. All right, so store.youclickthepros.com, you can get all of these. Baritone, the big baritones, the big, big baritones. I got videos on that. It's really a great place to go check them out, see the videos, check out all the specs, and then get the next baritone that you want. So I appreciate you being here. I'm excited that you're here. I mean, I'm just excited about all the stuff we got going on. We got a Patreon channel as well, just our YouTube channel here. We got all the social media stuff. We got a new platinum membership over at ukulelepros.com that I'm excited about as well. And then, like I said, we're giving away ukulele every single month. You got to subscribe to the channel and then click that link below to go sign up. So, all right, there you go. The Pono UL4-4. Hope you enjoyed it and we'll see you next time.